Babies born addicted to drugs, kids thrown into foster care because their parents would rather buy drugs than take care of them, young girls sexually assaulted by family members on drugs, people murdered over $20 drug deals gone wrong. That was the Attorney General for Montana telling the House Homeland Security Committee how illegal immigration has impacted his state. The committee began impeachment proceedings against Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas by hearing from attorneys general who are from states far from the southern border. The committee says it wants to show how illegal immigration has impacted the entire country. Criminal illegal immigrants are not content with growing only black market marijuana. They also produce and distribute fentanyl and they engage in sex trafficking and labor trafficking. Oklahoma's law enforcement community fights a constant battle against these evils. The Oklahoma Attorney General says immigration and an unsecure border cost his state's taxpayers $750 million a year. He says that includes added law enforcement costs like equipment and personnel, housing costs for those who are arrested and jailed at the local level, and costs of the fentanyl epidemic. Democrats brought in an attorney who testified that Mayorkas is doing his job by implementing the Biden administration's border policies. And that's not an impeachable offense, even if you disagree with those policies. If the official actions of the officer are in accord with the directives of his elected superior, the president removing the secretary changes nothing. If members of this committee disapprove of the Biden administration's immigration and border policies, the, Congress give, the, the, the Constitution gives this Congress a wealth of legislative powers to change them. Republicans say Mayorkas is not applying the laws the way Congress wrote them. They singled out the Biden administration's use of mass parole for immigrants. They say that's supposed to be done on a case-by-case -case basis. The scale of Secretary Mayorkas' mass use and abuse of parole is unprecedented and has been declared inconsistent with the laws passed by Congress by multiple federal judges. Democrats say there are no grounds for an impeachment and that Republicans are making this entirely political. They pointed to this report in the New York Times that revealed Green was ready to impeach Mayorkas back in April 2023 before the latest record-breaking immigration numbers. According to a recording of his comments obtained by the media, the chairman went on to tell those deep pocket contributors to, quote, get the popcorn and, quote, it's going to be fun. 